Hello everyone and welcome back to Mega Man, uh, the original for the Super N or Super NES, the NES Part 7. So, what I did, I went ahead and just cut out the very first part of getting back, you know, getting through all the stage, you know, the grinding and the first part of the stage. And I'm getting ready to head into and try to keep trying to beat Yellow Devil. Uh, first of all, I thought his Japanese name was Bumo. He just says that for Powered Up. That's how he talks. His name is still Yellow Devil. I am so stupid. Secondly, I'm actually having to record, uh, re-record this. Not the game footage. The game footage is fine. It's the... My webcam decided to decide to be all douchey. And... I don't know what happened, if it ended up recording from the wrong uh, mic, which the way it sounds, it sounded like it did. And I tried to mess with the audio, and it would, and it did not, it just didn't work. So I'm having, basically I'm commentating while watching my playthrough, which... I've, this is my third one doing it, because I recorded all my Mega Man ones at the same time. So all three of them, uh, Mega Man 2 Part 1, Mega Man 2 Part 2, and Mega Man, or Mega Man Parts, um, Part 7. And trust me, it's, uh, annoying to see that all three parts got messed up. Um... The gameplay is actually good, like, none of the rec um, gameplay footage was messed up. Which, that's... That was good. It was just my, the webcam part with my voice. Like, if it was the video part, I might have just edited it out and put a notice saying, Hey, no, you know, webcam footage of me, but no, it was the audio, not the video part, so... So, that's what I get to do. So, as you can see, my first attempt was pretty horrible. My second attempt is going pretty good. I finally started getting the pattern down. And it helped that I was able to at least get over, you know... Whoops, I messed up there. I mi Oh yeah, I remember screaming that I missed there. I don't know how the heck I managed to miss there, but I did. Now at least I got it there. I can't remember if this is the turn. I think I did spoil it in... I think it's Mega Man 2 Part 1. I spoiled it and said, yeah, I actually beat him. Beat Yellow Devil. Oh, yes. Yes! It was this turn. Look at him, he's all gone now. It's like he's fading into obscurity or something. But yes, I am so happy. I finally beat the sucker. Now it's time for more devil-ish crap. Because I didn't know what to expect. The boss rush. Like, I knew obviously it was coming. But I didn't realize that See, and, this, and that's why I couldn't go back. It's because I already saved. Because um, what I was thinking of, I was like, okay, I'll just re-record re everything. Like, uh, Mega Man's... The... Oh. Those things are annoying in cut stage, and they're annoying right here. Um... Shoot, I lost my train of thought. Oh, I'll still talk about my recordings. Um, I was gonna just re-record everything, but because of here, oh my god, I forgot that jumped, how stupid I was. Now, this is where I'm stupid. I do remember this, and I can't believe, I do point, I did figure it out later, but I don't know why I didn't I don't know why I didn't just continue, because I would have been, would have had all the lives, I would have had all, all my uh, powers 
uh, filled up. So I don't know why I did that. Eventually I figure it out. I just don't think I figure it out for a while. And I figured out how to actually dodge these guys successfully. Obviously not letting them respawn is a good is a good idea. And this is I'm like, yay! And I'm like, what? And look who it is again. Also, I noticed uh, Cut's weakness, Guts, there's no blocks around to throw at him. And I forgot how to beat him with the buster for a long while. Do I figure it out here? No, I do not. I'm still stupid. So yes, I do know I'm still stupid. But what I'm thinking of doing, because my first re-recorded session of me watching a video and commentating is the part one of Mega Man 2 that I started. I'm, for, I'm thinking of actually re-redoing that one because I was so awkward and so stupid on that one. I don't know why I switched to Guts. I honestly don't know why. Maybe I was hoping there were the blocks? Okay, I did switch back at least. No, I apparently did not. Oh, I think I was trying to see maybe I get in contact with him and I throw him or something? I don't know what I was thinking. But I know it takes me a while to get his pattern down. Because I kept freaking running into his cutter. Like that. Um, Cut, what was you doing there? Yeah, this whole... Good job, me. Do I figure do I figure it out this time? I do. I I decided to be smart. Now I save. Except I'm still haven't I still haven't smarted up on that part yet. I keep losing my train of thought because I keep seeing the stupidity on here. But I'm gonna re-record, re-re-re-record uh, Mega Man 2 Part 1 just because I was so awkward on that one that I'm just like okay. So I'm gonna end up re-recording that. Oh my gosh. I keep ha the more that's on the screen, the more painful it is for me. Why? Ooh, -hoo. it's like now that I'm watching this, I can see all the freaking mistakes I made. Why are there spikes up there? Why is why is that necessary for spikes to be up there? Oh, I think that's where I started. It's like once I get hit, I kind of start panicking. Also, another thing that I thought was stupid. Even when he's blowing up and he's dead, if the cutter can still freaking hit you, it still hurts you. And I think that's bullcrap. Uh, and then of course as soon as I saw those... I was like, you got to be kidding me. So you know what that means? It's Elect Man. I'm just like, okay. So I knew I was gonna die as soon as I get down there. I don't know why I'm pausing. Oh, I was trying to figure out where the hole was. I wasn't even prepared. I think I ended up jumping into his attack. No, he landed on me. Never mind. 
But I think what was frustrating was that I ended up being stuck back here, like at the beginning to where I'm gonna have to defeat Cut. Ooh, I did get another life. I think it's definitely wasted though. I can... Look at me, look at that pro dodging until, well, now. Look, I'm starting to wisen up. I still don't, I just now noticed those spikes still, and I'm still wondering why. Um, uh, okay. I know there was one time I actually get, well, not that time. But I think it was one time I actually did, I think I got hit by cut. I think it was only at the very end. He jumps around way too much. Oh, I jumped into that one. And I know what makes this Mega Man so hard is that there's no E-Tanks. There's no sub-tanks like in Mega Man X. And you... And the only health you get... Is basically from those. Which I'm kind of... Watching and I'm like... Yeah, I tried that and it's not... It's not worth it to get, try to get that down there. Oh, and that happened. Yeah, I was starting to get super salty. Yeah, I'm... I can almost guarantee you that this episode is going to be very, very short. Just because... Because it, I was getting so super salty, I had to stop playing before I... Like, threw something. And I thought Yellow Devil was going to be a pain in the butt? No. Actually, I'm kind of curious. Oh no, I still got a bit ways to go before I finally call in the towel. I'm also trying to watch the time on the video because I accidentally, for Mega Man 2 Part 2, I accidentally went over the video time. So there's a, there's definitely an awkward silence at the end where I'm just like, oh, the video cut out. <laughs> But I'm just, I'm looking at, watching this, and I'm like, everything, this whole thing is just a pain, it, I don't, I don't, I just don't know what to say. This whole thing is painful. It's like, if I can keep him from being a little jumper... Oh, I did do a get no hit by cut deal. Oh, sweet. That doesn't happen again. And it probably won't happen again. You know, I don't know why I didn't try to go for more health. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to remember that for my next, next time I try this. Oh, I think he ends up killing me here. <laughs> the rolling cutter was just like, bye. Just going, woo, into the distance. I think what's so frustrating about this part was the fact that there's no health thing. There's no... Oh man, this is making- this is... Painting me so much to watch. I think I finally start wisening up. Yep, I did. Finally. Oh yeah, this one I'm definitely not doing as hot on. 
I keep getting too close and I keep allowing myself to get hit by the... C I don't know why I just don't let him throw it. Oh, this part. I see where I get hit by the cutter still. And I still think that's bullcrap. Yeah, I remember pausing right there because I'm screaming at, as to why I still got hit when he's dying. Yeah, this boss boss rush is crap. Ooh, I almost fell off there. See, I don't know why I try to go. Because if I go back and forth, I can probably get health. I don't know why I don't do that. I just let him run. I think I just let him run into me because I was getting so frustrated. I was just like, I'm done. I'm done. Which honestly would not surprise me. Am I going to continue? Or... Awkward silence! I think, I, I think, if I remember right at this point, I'm just... I think I'm just sitting there in silence with my head back like, Ugh. Mega Man games make me so salty. Oh my gosh, last night when I was playing Mega Man X. And I was... I was on Sigma. I got to Sigma. And I was having... The dog I was... the His little dog cat pet thing I was having trouble with his like his I but his second part you know where he's actually fighting with his little saber thing um, that actually wasn't too bad to dodge a couple times I got hit but I was like okay that's not bad but his final form where he merges looks like it does he does merge with his pet oh my god all right let's see how bad i do and to basically correlate with what i'm with what's going on here it took me over an hour to beat him and i think i pretty i pretty much like halfway tossed Halfway just let it fall, halfway tossed the controller on the ground because I was so frustrated. I got beat up there. I got beat up there. But yeah, I was getting so salty. My girlfriend was like, maybe you should quit for now. Of course, I'm just like, no. Because I'm like, I'm on... So I ended up having to watch video on how to try to beat him because what I was doing, the little walkthrough I was using, um, it, to be honest, it wasn't helpful. It kept going, oh, you can easily dodge, you know, dodge the attacks and stuff. And meanwhile, oh, yes, again, that stupid getting hit by the cut, uh, hit by the cutter. That was, that's still stupid. I hate it. But oh my gosh. See, I just, I think. Yeah, as soon as I come, yeah. I'm gonna keep seeing that and I'm gonna keep thinking, okay, I can do this. Oh, jeez. Woohoo, I finally beat him. I am so happy. I finally be him. So now I don't know who's next. Though so who is next, I'm gonna, I freaking hate. Oh, look! Blowing up things! It's bomb! And then I do something stupid like that. I think, at yeah, at this point, I was just like, I'm done. I'm done. Oh no, I guess I do keep going. Hmm. No, I think I'm done after that. I think I do end up going to... Yeah. 
at this point, I was just like, I am done. So, yeah. But, yeah. In conclusion, this stupid boss, boss rush is stupid. The stupid Mega Man games are very salty. And this game is ridiculous. Ironically enough, I do still love it. But oh my gosh, it can make me so freaking mad. Heck, I am starting to get angry just from watching this and just from talking about it. Oh my gosh. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and... Go ahead and end the episode here. Um, see you for part 8. Hopefully it will be slightly more successful. I honestly don't know how my chances are, to be honest. But we will try. Alright, so I will see you guys for part 8. And I will see you later. Bye-bye.